welcome to this episode. As part of our AI series in which we leverage cutting edge AI technology to access and report back to you hidden facts about Africa, we have done something a bit unusual for our history channel. We have decided to take a very short break from studying the African past in this video and focus today on the future of African civilization. Where will Africa be in 2095, 70 years from now? For the answer, we turned to AI, ChatGPT. Why? Because using extremely powerful algorithms in a neural network of 200 billion parameters is capable of making logical predictions about the future based on past to current realities and development, including technological development trajectories of continents and nations. And so the question we asked it was, could you describe Africa in the year 2095? highlighting the main countries of growth and development and ending in a continental summary, right from a historical perspective linking the African past to its future. And here was the response. In 2095, Africa stands as a beacon of transformation, reawakening to its historical legacy of grandeur, power and innovation. The continent, having re-established its pre-colonial roots and cultural identities, has blossomed into a hub of technological, economic and social dynamism. Gone are the days of exploitation, division and external control. Now, the countries of Africa lead the global stage in quantum computing, artificial intelligence, sustainable development and a Pan-African renaissance. From the towering economic powers of the continent to the smaller nations fostering unique technological and cultural revolutions, Africa in 2095 is a living testament to the resilience and ingenuity of its people. Long before colonization, Africa was home to grand civilizations such as Kemet, ancient Egypt, Great Zimbabwe, the Mali Empire and the Ethiopian kingdoms. These empires were centers of learning, culture and trade, boasting advancements in astronomy, mathematics, architecture and medicine. Africa's trajectory in 2095 mirrors this era of greatness, a direct result of rediscovering and integrating the philosophies, technologies and governance systems of its ancestors. The re-establishment of these ancient connections has fostered a deep pride in African heritage, allowing nations to break free from Eurocentric frameworks and adopt a truly Afrocentric worldview. The catalyst for this resurgence has been a combination of technological advancements, political unity and a renewed cultural identity. African leaders have embraced their history while looking towards the future, fostering a blend of modernity and tradition that stands out globally. The rise of Africa as a technological and cultural superpower has been driven by its largest and most influential nations, though even smaller countries have made substantial contributions to the continent's renaissance. But we shall elaborate on the major power centers of the continent in 2095. By 2095, Nigeria is recognized as one of the leading quantum computing hubs globally, shaping the very fabric of the digital age. As early as the mid-21st century, the country began investing heavily in research and development, positioning itself to take advantage of the next technological frontier. With Lagos as its pulsating center, Nigeria houses some of the world's most advanced quantum research centers. These centers are not merely national achievements, but also attract global collaboration, making Nigeria a nexus for quantum innovation. Nigeria's rise is built on its deep pool of talent and a thriving startup ecosystem. Local innovators, educated in top tier African universities, have led the world in quantum cryptography, AI, and decentralized technologies. These technologies, rooted in African ingenuity, have transformed industries from finance to healthcare, creating quantum-enabled networks that span the continent. The Lagos Protocol, a set of quantum standards for data privacy and financial systems, has become the global gold standard for secure transactions and communication. But Nigeria's growth is not limited to quantum computing. A powerhouse of creativity is vibrant cultural industries, music, film, art, and fashion continue to captivate audiences globally, blending traditional Yoruba, Igbo, and Hausa influences with futuristic aesthetics. This marriage of ancient heritage and cutting-edge technology has enabled Nigeria to reimagine itself as a global trendsetter, mirroring the grandeur of the Nok and Benin kingdoms of old. 
South Africa, always a nation of contradictions, has come to embody the best of Africa's promise in 2095. After decades of political transformation, it emerged as a leader in renewable energy, fully powered by solar, wind, and geothermal resources. The country's Karoo region, once known for its semi-arid conditions, has become a bustling hub of solar farms and energy storage centers, supplying not only Africa, but also Europe and parts of Asia with clean energy. In addition to providing renewable energy, South Africa has also developed innovative technologies in water desalination, a significant breakthrough for the continent's arid regions. But perhaps South Africa's most astonishing leap forward has been in space exploration. The country's space agency, in collaboration with the African Space Union, established in 2060, leads missions that explore beyond the solar system. With AI-guided ships and quantum propulsion systems, South African scientists, alongside those from Kenya, Nigeria and Ethiopia, have placed Africa at the forefront of global space exploration. The endeavors echo the astronomical advancements of the ancient Dogon people of Mali, renowned for their knowledge of Sirius long before European astronomers. As Africa's leader in space exploration, South Africa builds on the ancient legacy of African stargazers, blending indigenous wisdom with cutting-edge space technologies. This renaissance has propelled the country to the global forefront, re-establishing Africa's age-old connection to the cosmos. Kenya, known for its rich cultural heritage and vast landscapes, has transformed into one of Africa's technological giants, particularly in artificial intelligence. The country's government, along with private enterprises, heavily invested in AI research early in the 21st century, turning Nairobi into Africa's AI city. Kenyan innovators have designed AI systems that revolutionize everything from agriculture and education to healthcare. Smart farming technologies now manage vast agricultural landscapes, ensuring food security across the continent by utilizing minimal resources while maximizing yields. Additionally, AI-driven healthcare systems have eradicated diseases that once plagued the continent. Kenyan AI doctors equipped with cutting-edge diagnostics are deployed via holographic interfaces in even the most remote regions. This advancement is reminiscent of the great African healers of old who blended spiritual wisdom with a deep understanding of herbal medicine. Kenya's AI revolution is also deeply intertwined with the country's commitment to human rights and equitable growth. By ensuring that AI development remains ethical and transparent, the country has avoided the pitfalls of AI exploitation seen in other parts of the world. As a result, Kenya has become a global leader in crafting ethical AI standards, echoing the wisdom of ancient African societies that prioritize community and the well-being of the whole. Ethiopia, a country with a history of resisting colonization and preserving its ancient culture, remains the cultural heart of Africa. In 2095, Addis Ababa, the continental capital of the African Union, is the political cultural and intellectual centre of the continent. The country has become a global tourist destination where travellers can immerse themselves in Africa's pre-colonial majesty. The ancient sites of Aksum, Lalibela and Gondar have been meticulously preserved and enhanced with AR and VR technologies offering visitors a direct connection to the grandeur of Africa's past. However, Ethiopia's influence is not limited to preserving ancient culture the country has also spearheaded the African language renaissance with the Gaya script being taught alongside newly revitalized African languages. As the birthplace of humanity and the cradle of African civilization, Ethiopia's universities and cultural centers foster an Afrocentric curriculum that reconnects African youth with their heritage while preparing them for the challenges of the future. The country is also a pioneer in the field of spiritual technology, fusing traditional spiritual practices with AI and biofeedback systems to create deep, transformative healing and growth. In many ways, Ethiopia in 2095 symbolizes Africa's ability to harmonize ancient wisdom with modern innovation. In 2095, Egypt has fully embraced its Kemetic roots, reasserting its position as a global leader in architecture, education and spiritual thought. The country, long regarded as a cradle of civilization, has restored its pyramids and temples, integrating them into modern urban landscapes and symbols 
of both ancient glory and contemporary achievement. The cities of Cairo, Alexandria and Aswan have become technological marvels using AI to enhance infrastructure, preserve the environment and ensure equitable growth. Egyptian engineers and architects guided by the ancient principles of geometry and cosmic alignment have developed some of the world's most breathtaking sustainable cities echoing the grandeur of the Great Pyramid of Giza while being fully powered by renewable energy sources. The influence of Kemetic spiritual practices has also permeated Egypt's educational system where philosophy, astronomy and ethics once studied in ancient temples are now taught in futuristic learning institutions. Egypt in 2095 symbolizes the fusion of Africa's ancient intellectual legacy with the demands of the 21st century and beyond. Ghana's role in 2095 is one of economic might, cultural pride and technological innovation. Accra, one of the world's fastest growing megacities, is the financial hub of West Africa thanks to visionary leadership that prioritized inclusive growth and regional trade. Ghana has become the continent's primary exporter of green technologies, including solar energy systems and advanced batteries. As Africa moves away from fossil fuels, Ghana's economy has boomed due to its leadership in sustainable technology. As Africa moves away from fossil fuels, Ghana's economy has boomed due to its leadership in sustainable technology and green finance. In the realm of digital finance, Ghana's golden city digital currency backed by blockchain technology is widely accepted across the African continent and beyond. It is a symbol of economic independence and self-reliance standing in stark contrast to the external control of African economies during the colonial period. Additionally, Ghana's educational institutions grounded in both local knowledge and continent research produce some of the brightest minds in the world, ensuring a continual pipeline of innovators who maintain the country's leadership in technology and business. Once known for its conflict surrounding its vast energy mineral resources, by 2095, the Democratic Republic of Congo has undergone an unprecedented transformation. Quantum computing, AI and advanced robotics have revolutionized the extraction and processing of minerals, drastically reducing environmental damage and eliminating exploitative labor practices. The DRC's vast reserves of cobalt, lithium and other rare earth minerals essential for quantum computing and AI systems have become the cornerstone of a new economic order in which the country controls its resources. However, what truly sets the Democratic Republic of Congo apart in 2095 is how the country has shifted from being a mere exporter of raw materials to becoming a leader in technological innovation. With its minerals now processed domestically by AI-driven eco-friendly technologies, the DRC has turned its vast resources into a foundation for homegrown industries. These industries produce quantum processors, AI chips and renewable energy solutions that power not just Africa, but the world. In addition to its technological prowess, the DRC has made major strides in ecological conservation, preserving its vast rainforests, one of the world's last great carbon sinks. The Congo River, long a lifeblood of the region, has been transformed into a source of sustainable hydropower, further driving the country's growth. Politically, the DRC has become more stable thanks to a combination of digital governance, AI-enhanced decision-making and Pan-African cooperation. This newfound prosperity allows the country to invest in social programs, infrastructure and education, improving the lives of millions of its citizens. In 2095, the DRC is no longer a symbol of exploitation, but of technological mastery and sustainable development. Senegal, home to ancient intellectual and spiritual centers such as Timbuktu, has re-emerged as a leading educational and cultural hub in 2095. Dakar is a vibrant capital, has become synonymous with cutting-edge educational systems that blend modern technology with African history and philosophy. Senegal's universities are world-renowned for their interdisciplinary approach, where students study quantum physics alongside traditional African cosmology and AI alongside ancient wisdom. The revival of the arts has also been central to Senegal's rise. The country has nurtured a pan-African cultural movement that has redefined fashion art, music and literature globally. Dakar is now a city where the ancient meets the future, 
where traditional Senegalese architecture blends seamlessly with ultra-modern skyscrapers designed using AI and sustainable materials. Senegal's position as an intellectual powerhouse has been further cemented by its leadership in governance and human rights. Drawing on its rich history of democratic values, the country has pioneered new forms of digital governance, ensuring transparency and citizen participation through blockchain-based systems. Senegal in 2095 stands as a model for how Asian African values can shape a future defined by technology, culture and education. In 2095, Africa is no longer defined by its colonial past but by its ability to reimagine the future through the lens of its pre-colonial grandeur. The continent has undergone a radical transformation shaped by technological advancements such as AI, quantum computing and renewable energy, all of which are driven by African ingenuity and innovation. From Nigeria's dominance in quantum computing to Kenya's leadership in AI and South Africa's advances in space exploration, African nations are now setting global standards in science, technology and governance. But Africa's resurgence is not just technological, it is deeply cultural. The continent has reconnected with its ancient roots, reclaiming its spiritual and intellectual traditions. Languages once forgotten are being revitalized. Ancient knowledge systems are influencing modern science and the rich cultural heritage of the continent is informing new global trends in art, fashion and philosophy. Pan-Africanism, an idea that gained momentum in the 20th century, has come to fruition in 2095. The African Union, headquartered in Ethiopia, has grown into a powerful political and economic body that ensures unity and collective progress across the continent. Borders, once a source of conflict, have become more fluid as trade, technology and culture flow freely between African nations. The African continental free trade area has transformed intra-African trade, making Africa one of the largest and most integrated markets in the world. With its growing economic clout, the continent is no longer dependent on the West or East for trade, but instead has positioned itself as a leader in sustainable development, tech innovation and cultural influence. Africa's rebirth has also had profound global implications. The rest of the world now looks to Africa not as a source of raw materials or a market for goods, but as a partner in solving the greatest challenges of the 21st century, climate change, technological advancement and human rights. The innovations coming out of Africa in 2095, rooted in both its ancient wisdom and modern ingenuity, are shaping the future of humanity. The African Renaissance of 2095 has redefined global power dynamics with the continent standing proud and self-reliant, having embraced its pre-colonial majesty while shaping a future built on justice, unity and progress. So that's it. That's the Africa of the future of 2095 based on its current development trajectory. So tell your children to tell their children to keep their eyes on and keep faith with the motherland. Thanks for watching this episode. Do remember to like, comment and subscribe and look out for the next one on Africa's Great Civilizations.